Hi, my name is Raj Bable, and I'm from Houghton, Michigan, which is up in the Upper Peninsula, so I'm a Uper. And uh, I just recently finished up my undergrad degree in electrical engineering in December of 2009. So originally I started electrical engineering because um, I wanted to do sound recording and um, there was another major in the School of Music that had very similar requirements. So I looked at the two and saw that electrical engineering would be the best way that I could still develop my math and science skills while um, being involved in music. But uh, about two years into the process I realized that although music is something that I really enjoy, I didn't want it to be the focus of my career. So. Um, I kind of put that aside and realized that um, another thing that I've been involved in that I would like to do is community development. And the beautiful thing about electrical engineering is that it's such a diverse major that you can do that. You can move from stuff like sound recording into community development. Uh, the way I'm, I see myself doing that is through solar power. I'm interested in the idea of sustainability and um, my degree in electrical engineering is actually proving to be a pretty good fit for that. Um, in the first semester of my senior year, I began a project uh, in rural India, actually in my mother's ancestral village. And uh, the school there, Nana Bodhani School, has a computer lab, but unfortunately because of their unreliable grid power, they have no way to drive the computers. So um, coming from my background in electrical engineering and my interest in solar power, I saw this as the perfect way to put together some of the pieces of my life that I had been working towards. So I began this project where we decided to try and power a com the computer lab at Nanabaldini School using solar power. And in the same semester, I signed up for a class offered uh, by Professor Ian Hiskins um, called Grid Integration of Alternative Energy Sources. And so it was pretty much the perfect class for what I was doing with this project in that it gave me the theory behind um, what we were trying to do in India. And um, so across that entire semester, I talked to Professor Hiskins a lot when I was developing a proposal, when I was looking into different parts, when I was looking for context, and he helped me through the whole process, and it's coming along really well. We're powering all 20 of the school's computers, and um, just two weeks ago, I signed the paperwork with a company out in Tempe, Arizona to donate the solar panels. So um, it's been one of these beautiful things for me because it's something I care about, it's something I was going to do anyway, and um, it's because of my electrical engineering background, it's because of the classes I took at Michigan that I was able to put the pieces together to do this big thing that has now become one of the coolest things I'm involved in. Coming out of the University of Michigan, I feel very privileged to have this opportunity and this huge force behind me. I've been given this tool set and now it's up to me to really put it to use. And so when I think about my motivation, it's really to maximize um, what I can do as a person um, to make the world a better place. While moving through your college time, it's also good to remember not to do things only for school because as, as the saying goes, not all of your education is inside the classroom. Two of the big things I've been involved with are alternative spring break and another uh, student group I was in is uh, the Engineering Honor Society Tau Beta Pi. And um, that's a great organization because um, it provides this framework to do a lot of community service events. So. Um, again, I, I really like the idea of having the chance to step outside of the campus bubble and see more than just the academic world. My favorite thing about um, the University of Michigan is probably the huge number of, of resources that you have. Um, I think everybody's four or five years in college, for me it was five, um, really influences the rest of their lives. It's a very personal experience and it's a very life-changing experience. I know for me it certainly has been. And I really feel lucky to be coming from the University of Michigan's electrical engineering department because I really think it has prepared me to do the work that I want to do.